I'll, I'll have students work with inquiry. I tend to favor uh, if there's a certain pattern that particularly is challenging to get a hold of, I have them start with the inquiry of what's good about it. Because there's some investment that we have, there's some reason we're holding on to that pattern of behavior or that attitude or belief. So if we look at what's good about it, and ultimately there's something protective in it is usually the case. I, even though it's something we, we don't like on some level, it does give us a sense of safety or stability or recognition. You know, I know who I am because I have this going on. So, so it's looking at that and, and also um, I encourage people to, to somatically locate it. Where in your body is that sensation, is that feeling? You know, if you have a feeling of dread or feeling of uneasiness, anxiety, well, where is it exactly in your body? Most of us assume those things are everywhere. My whole body is anxiety. Well, probably not. So we begin to isolate and recognize, oh, it's in my left leg and in my, my belly. Okay, well, describe the feeling, really flesh out the experience, and then quantify it. It's, it's just in these areas. Once that's clear, then there's a practice I introduce called what else is here, and to see what else is happening in your body. And typically something else will be going on that's beneficial. People can experience joy, peace, something, um, something else. So then again, quantify that. Where's the peace? Uh, my right leg and my head, I feel peace. Okay. Now can you hold the anxiety and the peace together without doing anything? And as they coexist, they begin to communicate in some fashion through some mysterious process. And because really what's happening is the Absolute is presenting us with a balm to meet the, the problem we're experiencing. And that helps us relax about it, soothe it, calm it down. And then a lot of times we can then go a little deeper into, say, the anxiety. What's that about? What's the history? When did that first start? And we can see the pattern of that. And that helps if we can work those memories that can often help unplug that little by little until it uh, can be fully unplugged.